Unmanned aerial vehicles, once the stuff of science fiction, have rapidly become a defining feature of modern warfare. From reconnaissance and surveillance to targeted strikes, their roles have steadily expanded. This evolution is driven by advancements in stealth technology, artificial intelligence, and drone autonomy. Stealth, in particular, is crucial. It allows UAVs to operate undetected in contested airspace, making them invaluable assets in modern military strategies. The S-70 Okotnik B, Russia's latest foray into unmanned combat aerial vehicles, embodies this trend. This heavy strike UAV, often called the Hunter, is designed to penetrate enemy defenses and deliver precision strikes. Its development reflects Russia's ambition to remain competitive in a rapidly evolving military landscape. The global stage is witnessing a renewed arms race with nations vying for technological supremacy. The S-70 project began in the early 2010s, shrouded in secrecy. The Sukhoi Design Bureau, renowned for its fighter jets like the Su-35 and Su-57, spearheads the development. Early prototypes resembled the American X-47B with a flying wing design intended to minimize radar signature. The first flight of the Okotnik B took place in August 2019, marking a significant milestone for Russia's drone program. Initial testing focused on basic flight characteristics and control systems. Subsequent phases involved more complex maneuvers and the integration of weapon systems. The Okotnik B is designed to operate in tandem with manned aircraft, such as the Su-57, acting as a loyal wingman. This concept involves the UAV being controlled by a nearby fighter jet, extending the operational reach and lethality of both platforms. The Okotnik B boasts an impressive array of technical specifications. Weighing in at approximately 20 tons, it has a range of 3,700 miles and can reach speeds of up to 620 miles per hour. The drone is powered by a single Saturn AL-31F turbofan engine, the same type used in the Su-35 fighter jet. While not a true stealth aircraft like the Su-57, the Okotnik B incorporates several stealth features. Its flying wing design, internal weapons bay, and radar-absorbent materials all contribute to a reduced radar cross-section. The Okotnik B is believed to be capable of carrying a variety of air-to-ground and air-to-air -air missiles. These include precision-guided bombs, anti-radiation missiles, and potentially even hypersonic weapons. The drone sensor suite is equally impressive, featuring advanced electro-optical systems, infrared search and track, and active electronically scanned array radar. This allows the Okotnik B to conduct reconnaissance, surveillance, and target acquisition independently or in conjunction with other platforms. The development of the Okotnik B has not been without its setbacks. In 2021, during a live fire exercise, an S-70 prototype was accidentally shot down by friendly fire. While such incidents are not uncommon in military testing, it highlights the challenges of integrating unmanned systems into existing air defense networks. The incident also raised questions about the drone's sensor capabilities and its ability to distinguish between friendly and hostile forces. Despite this setback, the Okotnik B represents a significant leap forward for Russian military technology. Its deployment has the potential to alter the balance of power in key regions, particularly in Eastern Europe and the Asia-Pacific. The drone's ability to penetrate enemy airspace and deliver precision strikes could pose a significant challenge to NATO forces. However, the Okotnik B's true effectiveness remains to be seen. Its performance in a real-world combat scenario is still untested, and its vulnerability to sophisticated air defense systems is yet to be determined. The future of the Okotnik B, and indeed of unmanned combat aircraft in general, is full of both promise and uncertainty. As technology continues to evolve at an unprecedented pace, the line between science fiction and military reality will continue to blur.